Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Uh, today it's sort of a tool review really. I've had a few people ask over the periods of my videos, oh what screwdriver do you recommend for this or whatever. Now if you only want to be doing messing around with changing bracelets or um, say maybe changing the, the uh, bezels on Zins with their captive bezels, these are great. Basically, the Bergeon set you see here. Now, if I take this one out, because it will make sense in a minute, you basically can buy these from the likes of Cousins or Walsh's. Uh, I think Cousins is possibly the cheaper of the ones. I'm not 100% sure there, but you can pick this up for under £50. And what it is, it's just these screwdrivers in a plastic pack. And to be most nine times out of ten that will do you for all you really need you can pretty well sort these are very good quality screwdrivers they um a nice steel shank on them uh the top is plastic though but they are incredibly well made and toughened heads on there now these yeah are really good and if you later want to kind of um not really upgrade but improve upon us a little bit you can buy this nice little block for them now the block i think i paid about under 30 quid for now you can make a block you don't even need this block but i find it's just easier when i'm picking up screwdriver uh, screwdriver and i know if i want a slightly smaller i just grab it from there it just makes my life a little bit easier you also have the holes in the back for sticking the spare blades in there if you show so desire now i sometimes think they've done this on purpose but the pack only comes with five screwdrivers and of course you have a sixth hole here so you can't out but buy the next screwdriver but to be fair you need this if you're going to be doing any serious tinkering around with watch movements you need the two millimeter here um on the ratchet wheel crown wheel whatever you want that larger screwdriver and so when you actually put this all in price wise oh it does have a nice rubber base on it so it sticks on the bench quite well when you work out the complete price if you're saying about 50 quid for the screwdrivers by the time you add this is about another uh, 10 or 11 pounds roughly this was around about 20 uh, high almost 30 so you're talking it's around about 90 pounds roughly i'd say roughly round about there and it is a it's a great set it's a set i use here um at my bench but what i actually use at university is the horitec ones here now these are more expensive this comes in let me zoom out a little bit so you got better perspective um these come in i think around about one 160 pounds roughly now the big difference is here obviously there are more of them you're talking you've got what is it eight um here so you basically get a slightly larger one there the 2.5 as well which yeah you, know, you, know, you definitely need i think anyway and you get the spare blades the spare blades come in there and most importantly which i think is uh actually a, an absolute killer feature is the base it's just yeah it's just nice when you you want a screwdriver you just turn it yeah it it's it, you don't need it but it just it yeah it is a nice one there is a corresponding uh Bergeon set which have aluminium shanks and a rubber surround but still with plastic tops i really do not like the feel of at all um the the base as well just isn't as nice i do prefer the horitec but that's just how you stand like as i say here if i look at this big difference the knurling is a lot thicker but the shank is a fraction smaller the top is fully anodized um, and feels really nice um the the only difference i would say is possibly the when you actually look zoom in really closely on the tips you can actually see grain marks on these where the bergeons are almost polished but it doesn't really matter because you're going to be sharpening them anyway. You're going to be you know, messing around sharpening them quite a bit. Just one of those things. They're both as hard as each other. The only little mod I did, I took the grubs, I backed the grub screws off. And with an oiler, I applied a tiny bit of thread lock just to make sure they don't come loose. But that can happen, but it won't happen now. 
Um, rubber base as well on this and hours of entertaining fun just spinning your screwdrivers around. So for university I use these, for home I use this here, um, which is perfectly adequate for what I'm doing at home. Anyway, hope that um, helped if you're interested in screwdriver sets and what you can buy out there. And I'll see you in the next video, guys. You stay safe. Bye.